Hey, Christina here from Elementor. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to go from a blank page to a full page using Elementor AI to speed up your workflow, saving you hours. We're going to walk through a number of AI features that can empower us to work faster. So let's start with a blank canvas. So begin by setting up your brand style with global colors and fonts. Next, add your background color. Now let's set up AI context. This allows Elementor's AI engine to understand the overall context of your website, enabling it to customize text and images better suit your specific needs. In this example, I'm creating a food travel website. For AI context, I'm adding key information about my website, such as voice and tone, communication style, target audience, and business niche. If you're building a site for a brick and mortar business, you might include details like your business hours, address, and key information about your services or products, along with any important frequently asked questions. All right, so now I wanna add a hero section. Click on the pink star in the container. A prompt bar appears where you can describe the type of section you wanna build in plain text. You'll receive three layout options to choose from. You can always click regenerate for new layout options in the bottom left corner of the pop-up. Okay, so after selecting the container I like, you'll notice and add a container with Copilot button. This feature really speeds up the workflow, allowing you to quickly create each section down the entire page. The algorithm pulls data from the AI context to suggest sections and automatically applies the global fonts and colors we set earlier. Copilot also generates the copy based on your business's voice, tone, and niche. Again, you'll get three layout options to choose from with the ability to click through them using the arrows. Now that I've finished building out my homepage, let's move on to some fine tuning. I'm going to generate an image now, an image background by entering a prompt and size. Okay, this image looks great. I've added a background overlay to improve the contrast. Of course, at any time, you can always add a new color to the global color settings without leaving the page. Okay. So next, I'm adding images related to food travel. I've used AI to generate an image I like for food travel in Paris, and I'm using the new cleanup tool to improve it by removing unwanted parts. Okay, moving further down the page now, I want to add my own little twist. I'll change the text and translate it into local languages. Perfect for a travel website. With one click, I'm translating the text into Italian, French, Japanese, and Thai, all without leaving the page. Now I'll show you how to take an AI generated image or any image you upload and remove the background to make the image pop. With a click, you can quickly isolate the subject from the image and finish off this section. We're in the home stretch now. So to keep visitors engaged, I'm adding some animation with custom CSS. 
There's no need to write the code from scratch. I simply describe what I want, and if you're stuck, you can always check the Elementor AI prompt library for inspiration and adapt it to your liking. So that's it. All the sections of the page are adapted for both desktop and mobile. From a blank page to a travel site, all that's left is to click Publish. Hope you enjoyed this tutorial. I'm Christina from Elementor. See you next time. Elementor, create websites, design your future.